Okay, so somebody's asked to tell him a little bit about how to use flower support netting. So this is a great example. This is coxcomb that's just growing up through the netting. Um, the netting is held in place by garden stakes, serious garden stakes. These are two by twos. Um, I also like to use metal T-posts. The netting actually sits on the post. It's just held there tauntly. Um, you want it to rest at the halfway to maturity for the plants, and these are still kind of growing up, and you'll see as we go down this row here, um, they get a little bit taller. And you can see the flowers just grow right up through the netting. And about every 10 or 12 feet along the bed, there's more posts, one on each side. That holds the support netting tautly from side to side. And as we walk down this bed of coxcomb, you can just see, this is good because the foliage is kind of dark, you can see it just grows right up through it. Um, and once you learn how to harvest through netting, I can do it quickly, efficiently, um, and it works great because I'll tell you, this, this coxcomb is probably already 36 inches tall. If it was not netting, netted, first rainstorm it would all be on the ground so support netting is really easy to use um, you just have to have strong stakes and um, get it on you put it on while the plants are under 12 inches so they just grow up through the netting so really simple to use and I'm putting a link here um, our product link which also lists some details about it so there you go, your flowers will never go down.